Hey everybody, I hope you guys are all healthy and safe. So for those of you who have followed my channel for quite a while, you may notice that I've been shooting in this type of background for the last couple of months. It's a pretty nice looking patio, pretty stylish. So the reason for this change is because I moved into a co-living space. It's basically um, kind of like a dorm for adults. We each get our own private room, but we share the common areas, but the common areas are huge. So I, I've been loving living here because I just love working out on this patio and also we have a really nice co-working space down on the first floor. However, there is one problem with this co-living space. It is that almost all the electrical outlets is covered in a little plastic covering like this. Now I kind of understand why this needs to be done because it kind of protects against uh, if it rains, against water. But unfortunately, I use a 16 inch MacBook Pro and this is Apple's 96 watt charging brick and this brick is actually too bulky to plug into most of the outlets in this place. Let me show you. So see I cannot plug this in completely because this little plastic case is blocking the outlet because the outlet is so big. I have this problem with the big table down in the common area too. I also cannot plug this into that table. So that has made things a little bit annoying because that means whenever I work out here or on a big table in the common area, I cannot power this 16 inch MacBook Pro. I have to just use battery power, which is fine for if I'm writing. But when I'm editing videos, this thing will only last about maybe two hours, three hours maximum. Then after that, I need to plug this thing in before it dies. And I can't plug it in out here. I can't plug it in down the big table. So what I have to do is I have to take this laptop all the way up to my room. So because the 16 inch MacBook Pro uses so much power, a typical portable battery pad, like the small ones that you see people charge their phones with, those batteries cannot charge this laptop. And so I was quite excited when this company emailed me asking if I want to test this new portable battery pack. As you can see, this battery is a little bit bulky, but there's a reason for that because the capacity is 40,200 milliamp hour and there's not one, but two USB-C PD ports. So PD stands for power delivery. Each of these um, output powers at 100 watts. So even more than the 96 watt brick here. So that means with this portable battery pack now, I can now charge my MacBook Pro without needing to take it up to my room. I can charge it wherever I'm at actually. That's not all. As you can see, in addition to the two USB-C ports, you also have a USB-A port and two DC ports here. That's because the maximum power output of this battery is 360 watt. That's enough to power most appliances. This can actually charge my electric bike, which is quite bulky in size. Now, normally speaking, because Hong Kong is quite a developed city, I don't have much use for such high power output. But if you live in an area where power outages are common, this could come in very handy. Like for example, people in Texas did not have electricity for two days. So if people in Texas have one of these or two of these lying around, they can first charge up their smartphone definitely for enough times so over two days, even five, six days. And this thing outputs enough power to power a small microwave, a small oven, and even a small refrigerator. Okay, there's one more reason why I wanted to cover this portable battery. It's because the name of this battery is called Power Ben. Power Ben. I'm Ben's gadget review, so I feel like I kind of have to cover it. With the packaging of Power Band, you also get a lot of cables to help you charge everything. You get a USB-C to USB-C. This is crucial. This is what you need to charge your MacBook, any other smartphone. And you also have a bunch of cables here. So these are all DC outputs, inputs, so you can plug it in. And then it even comes with a lot of these adapters, so allow you to charge anything you can think. So most gadgets or appliances, if they don't use USB-C or micro USB, they will probably use one of these plugs. So basically here already has me covered to charge whatever the heck I need. Now, as you saw earlier, there's also an LCD screen here that shows you crucial information like your battery percentage. And when you're charging something, it will also show you the voltage and uh, output, like how much power the device is taking from this battery. Now topping up this battery, you can do so via any of these DC ports or the top USB-C plug right here. So that's about it as far as covering the power band. For me personally, I'm going to use this mostly for charging the 16 inch MacBook Pro out here in this beautiful patio, but unfortunately it does not have a plug for me 
to uh, use properly. So the power band right now is not on sale in retail stores yet. It is crowdfunding on Indiegogo. I'll have a link in the description below if you're interested in checking it out. I personally just thought this battery is very useful because I've been annoyed with not being able to charge this thing out here. So anyway, that's about it for this video. I have a lot more content coming up, including on the Xiaomi Mi 11 Ultra, the Xiaomi Mi Band 6, and a couple of Honor devices too. So if you're interested in keeping up to date with the latest gadgets, please consider subscribing to my channel or follow me on Instagram at Ben's Gadget Reviews. That's it for now. Thanks for watching.